Okay, this is Mr. Solomon. Welcome to another edition of Minecraft EDU. Today we're going to be using a mod with first graders to help them learn how to spell. And they're going to be spelling colors and numbers. So we're using our large workspace. We've used this for several projects and students are working in pairs. So right now I'm in build mode. So we're going to check in on some of these guys and see how they're doing. So they were asked to work with a partner. One partner will be spelling colors and the other partner will be spelling numbers. So you can see we've got kids using the spelling blocks and the number blocks. These are both mods available for Minecraft EDU. And this is a really nice job so you can see how they're using cyan which I wasn't expecting them to spell. So they're spelling the words and then using the correct colored block to correspond. To find these mods, you'll see them under English letter blocks. And you have capital letters and lowercase. And then here you have number mods. So students have access to these. And these are available on the Google group from maze, letter blocks, and number blocks. So we'll check in on some other students as the class goes on. But this is a really good example of how to teach students spelling and quantity. Okay, it's been about 10 minutes since we last checked in on this project. So let's take a look around and see what we have here. These guys really have the hang of it. So this is kind of what I was looking for. So they're learning how to spell and they're learning how to get the corresponding colors. And then the other partner is doing the spelling of the numbers. And so they're using the mods. It's a little tight. I could probably make a little space around here. But as we keep looking around, there's another group that spelled three colors so far. That's about it. Here's a group that's starting. You can tell that different kids are working at different paces. So it's really a fun way to learn how to spell words and how to spell numbers. I'm going to try to touch on every group so you can at least get a quick uh, visual of where everybody is. It's good that they work in teams. It's interesting how they don't choose all the same uppercase or lowercase. And this one I should be seeing numbers, so I'll have to talk to this, this group. So they're not quite doing the numbers correctly, but they've got the spelling of the colors right. So we're getting there. For a lot of kids it's their first time playing Minecraft so they're just still learning all the controls and how everything works. But I wanted to share how we're using this mod. Looks like I just got teleported. So this is group 12. But it's really a highly engaging activity the kids really like. And it teaches them how to use the controls in Minecraft as well, of how to manipulate their inventory. So I was going to talk to those two before. So we're getting there. And I'll check in one more time. We have one more day. We'll work on this tomorrow. And hopefully the goal is to have at least, uh, I'm hoping to see five colors and five numbers for first grade. That's a pretty good uh, expectation. So this group's doing interesting. Got it laid out quite well. Someone didn't put a number after their name. This group needs to work on their spelling. I'll have to find out who that is. Okay, so number two. That one looks good. It's looking pretty good. So it gives them a chance to explore the different materials too. So this is the first time I've tried this, but I really like having a uh, mod for spelling letters. And so I plan to use this again with some of the lower grades to give them some practice. And we'll have to talk about how to spell some of these words right. So it's a good assessment on whether they can do some of that.